halberd. Long hilted weapon mixing spear and axe and is difficult to handle, requiring both strength and dexterity. The halberd has two elementary attacks, spear like thrusting and large sweeping swings. However, one false swing and the wielder is left wide open. So uh, I'd say check the move set out when you're in better safety, but uh, it's, it's got some cool stuff you might like, uh, including the ability to block and stab. Okay. Yeah, you're a fan of uh, shield stabbing, right? It's not my favorite move set, but it's just I did it in my I, I did it in my run uh, of of DS1 for the first time because I had never played a build like that before. Like I'd played all the other games ignoring the weapons that let you block and stab at the same time. Um, so I just wanted to see what it was like, and I was like, oh, that's interesting. It's a different way to play. You know, you have to be a, you have to be smart about your stamina because you gotta you see that's risky. Yeah. That's that's when you gotta be careful about when you're, you're doing that, right? R two, yeah. Especially like in your 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 normal R two is also still pretty good, but like the the timing is, hey, you got a baller shield, aka a baller shield. <laughs> you want to check that out? Baller swag. Baller swag shield. <laughs> I see. Get it? I see. Baller swag sword. Baller swag, bro. Okay. <laughs> 9K. <laughs> I see you. <laughs> we see you, buddy. We see you. We see you. <laughs> Shield of the Knights of the ancient kingdom of Baldur, tweaked for improved stability. Baldur was the home of the Night King Rendal, but the kingdom was reduced to ruins after a widespread outbreak of undead. Okay. Stats? Uh... The reduction is... I mean, it is stable. Is that much stability uh, worth it? Uh, you're, you're, it's a little bit heavier. Um, and you're getting less magic and fire reduction. But you're you're getting some big stability. And, and what that is going to do is it's going to reduce the amount of stamina um, that you're going to lose per hit. And that will make a big difference to your blocking. That sounds good. Your blocking will get better. Might as well. Check your roll. Oh, am I heavier? Yeah. Mm. Where are you at? 27. You're not far. Yeah. I need to lose mm, Drop point gloves. 7. Check your roll. Yeah, we good now. Mm -hmm. There you go. All right. Good drop. Big uh, blocks, big swings, big helmet. So did we come from here? You yes. did. That's where and you fought the, the real right boy. Side. Okay. Another. That's one. a big room. Actually, uh, okay. Yeah, go in. You have the halberd to check out too. But surprise, motherfucker! Action is happening, so deal with that later. Hmm. Oh shit! That was a multi-attack. You gotta, you gotta, one, learn two, the string. Three. You know. I thought I was going to shield that. I thought I was going to shield that and live. If he, if he doesn't bounce off, or if he's still doing stuff, big slow attack, not going to cut it. All right. That's going to get you killed. I yeah. put it in your brain, and I earwormed you. And now you're using it like it's an all situation thing, and you're gonna die because of it. It's very situational. I recommend it for the staircase when you had the high ground. The rest of the times, you're gonna get yourself. Killed. Oh my god, okay. Alright? Okay. It is good damage. It is fantastic damage, but there's other ways to get damage. Safer ways to get damage. Especially if you kick first, like you, like you know, you get them a little bit. Like, oh, now they're open. 
then you can get yourself a nice uh, a nice big swing if it's if it's safe. Oh, that's a nice deflect off there. Yeah. Trying to get the back one. It's hard. Yeah, oh they're 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 fast. Yeah. These dudes are these dudes are nimble. Cause they're real. Because they're baller swag dudes. Oh, I almost had the back this time. These stupid archers. So annoying. Damn, son. Now you're playing some Dark Souls. Fighting on the steps. Knight versus knight. Arrows in the ass. <laughs> right up the bum. That's, that's the experience right there. Three hits. So you had the inside of the, the this this building over here, mm -hmm. and you had the the wooden bridge that you'd never crossed. Oh yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I was going around this area first, right? Yeah, and then I, you and then you look. Well, I'll keep look. going since okay. that was my first uh, impression. I'll come back if anything. I know there's a dude on the right, on the left, rather. Yeah. You know what? Why not? Oh! Oh! You cute! You cute! He backdashed, but he Yo. got caught. He got caught. Active frames. Oh, you just don't want to deal, huh? Oh, damn, damn, damn. No, it's too slow. Dagger, you're okay. Okay, push the body, the shard. shard. Press A to confirm the prompt. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Mental level ups! We're clearing those prompts! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he looks massive. Does it, is it just me or? Maybe it's just the scale of the room. Hard to say. <laughs> this um, Okay. You're going straight to fireballs as you're. As you're... Uh, what was that? Okay, well, there's some shit up there. I see. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Did I miss something in this room? No. Do I need to pass by the other way? Yep. Nah, nah. It makes sense. It makes sense. I, I've learned from the Taurus demon. Like, okay, there's some shit up there. If I go over there, he's gonna harass me. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the other area. Because. Because. Uh, yes, around this part, and then the word? Don't forget your surroundings. Nice. Oh, you want some too? He didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but now he does. Yeah, that's right. My hood. My hood. Okay, let's, let's hit that bridge. You feel yourself. A bit. I got us sometimes. It's fine. All right. I, th I, th I thought the bridge was going to break on me too. <laughs> but it's totally fine. Hey. Hey. Stab. All right, all right. Yo, we're moving. We're making movement with this sword. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, look around. Forest. That is a forest. There's some trees. Okay. Don't look too, too closely at them though. What? <laughs> Otherwise, their illusion will be revealed. They're cardboard. Uh <laughs> They're like layers. They're fucking look, look, like like They're super stiff. <laughs> tilt the camera up. They're cardboard. Yes. <laughs> don't look. Don't look too hard. Beautiful, beautiful. I love it. Try humanity. So you got that pathway back behind you, over that way, and then you got big boy in here. Okay. 
Okay, you're fighting here. All right. Just wanted to touch that blood stain, you know? Yep. Try parrying. I think that's a general statement. <laughs> Be wary of blacksmith. What's that sound? Imminent detour. So this area looks Need like that. Yeah, this looks like a pulpit of some kind. You know, a pulpit. It looks like a, like a like a like a thing that you put your. It's like where you preach from. Yeah, you know, almost like an altar or something. Yeah, I, I can't quite talk about the rocks in this room for an hour. I, I we have friends that can, but uh, this room looked like it used to. You know, something was going on. Anyway, why don't you head down those stairs? Yeah. I like the sound of that, though. Tink, tink, tink. You like back of blacksmiths? Yeah, they're usually nice. What about that? You like that? I like that, too. All right. Maybe even more than a blacksmith. Take a seat. Get you comfy. Gotta sit down. Get comfy. This bonfire yeah. is going to serve you well. <laughs> <laughs> you are going to spend a good amount of time getting used to this bonfire right here. Okay. Bonfire Chan, she's she's here waiting for you. Um, let me pop like six hundred to get two levels. How about that? You can do that. You can also take the two soft humanity on your body right now that you earned by clearing out that last zone. Okay. Because you, when you kill enemies in an area, there's a chance as you kill, as you clear out an area, that you will make soft humanity, which is the number next to your life bar. Two. As you play, right? Uh, of course, when you die, you drop them, you can pick them back up. But once you clear the boss out, that doesn't happen anymore. So uh, what you could do is you could make that bonfire uh, give you more than five Estus by kindling it. And it would give me 10. Yes. So can't be doing it by while hollowed. So you have to first reverse kindling. Reverse hollowing, which takes one. Now you're going to become human. Okay. Which means you'll be online and, you know, invadable slash helpable. And we're doing it. And then two. And you can get that Estus. Kindle. There you go. Yo. Now you got 10 sips. To the fire. And this is a good place to put 10 sips. And every time I come here, it will be 10. At this one. Okay. Fire link. It has default 10. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. And here too. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, that's super interesting. So you can pick your bonfires and decide which ones to kindle. And it costs a humanity to do so. Okay. This is the best use of your humanity. Now it makes a lot of sense. There's other great things that it can do for you. This is the best one. Cool, cool, cool. All right, what do you want? Um, I want to pop some souls. Do you want to go? Do you want to go see what the tinkering is about? And and yeah, maybe there's options over there, right? Might 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 want to shop. As, as long as I don't die on the way there. How far is the journey? Is it this way? It's literally one floor down. The journey is three sets, of, three flights of stairs. There's a blood stain, though. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> How'd that get there? Amazing chest ahead. I guess this way. Uh, yeah, look at it. Do you agree? <laughs> you don't agree? No. <laughs> yeah, I like his hair his beard but what about that chest <laughs> it's not oily enough a little slow on the uptake there <laughs> it's, it's, it's not oily enough I'll take a second <laughs> well you must be a new arrival I'm Andre of a store rat. if they require smithing then speak to me this so boy there's Andre and Soler of Astor uh was that it 
Did he introduce himself that way? No, he didn't give you his name. Yeah, he said Soler of something. I think he said Soler Astora. Did, did he actually say his name in that introduction? I think so. Okay. Well, excuse me then. So, let's talk. See what he's all about. I thought, um... Oh, anyway. Uh, and you don't find this out in the game, but, um, the gentleman from the beginning that, that, uh, drops the, the thing yes. in, your, in your cell that you... The, yeah, the knight, yeah. Uh, his name is Oscar. Okay. Of Astora. A lot of Astora. It's a place. Okay. Man, I wonder if uh, Astora is still good. <laughs> if they're that? all fleeing. <laughs> I thought you learned that gesture. Hurrah! Yeah. Okay. So this dude right here, no nonsense. He fucking... He's here to blacksmith. And that's what he talks about. They're all like that. And that's what he does. <laughs> to the like point. demon souls. Most weapons and armor are mighty sturdy indeed. But every hunk of metal has its breaking point. If you notice durability running low, it's time to repair. You can ask a blacksmith like myself, or do it on your own with a grindstone. The nice thing about weapons, they never betray you. Mm. So pay them a little respect, eh? It's good advice. I do respect my weapons. Yeah. Uh, so, he's got... Uh, you can keep talking. About there him. are two types of weapon forging. There's reinforcement and there's ascension. Reinforcement is simple. It strengthens the weapon and nothing more. A simple task for any blacksmith. Hell, you could even do it yourself with a smith box. But Ascension's a finer art. It alters the weapon's properties. Ascension is the territory of we blacksmiths. A smith box just won't do the trick. Start out with reinforcement. When that loses its charm, you can consider Ascension. As you've noticed, this land is flush with the mad and wicked. You won't make it through the night without employing my services. <laughs> he ain't talking shit. So a quick uh, reminder is uh, reinforced weapon is, is to make the number go up. And modify is to change it to a fire, mm -hmm. lightning, yeah, you know, etc. Divine. Okay. Um... Let's keep on talking. You can forge armor just like you do weapons. Forging armor is even easier than forging weapons. Whether you forge weapons or armor first, well, that's up to you. But nobody wants to see you go hollow. So whatever you do, you'd better do it well. <laughs> 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 yeah, what he's not going to tell you is uh, sometimes you're using the same upgrade, uh, uh, same upgrade um, uh, chunks or, or shards to upgrade your armor as well, and then you might find a better piece of armor and take off oh. the one you're currently wearing. So if you know upgrading armor is like unless you really want to wear that one, unless you're sure you're going to rock that, uh, you know sometimes it's a waste of material okay. in my opinion but i found the set that i really love that i intend to keep forever and i upgraded that shit to plus five you know oh uh -huh. must have been some cool side effects to that it just makes it better yeah mm, okay okay yeah, he said that. yep there you go okay so which menu should i hit first First, I just want to like, see how it looks. Yeah, you're probably not going to see anything here. Special ember required. You got to find the special ember. Reinforce weapons, and that's for the pluses. So it, you can look at the top right to see the requirements for the upgrade, right? So if you want that long sword to go to plus one, it's going to cost you uh, two hundred souls and a shard. Exactly, and if you press square. You can see exactly how much it's going to go up by. Oh, very much. Very good, very good, very good. Now, 80 goes to 88, right? Mm -hmm. And then the 15 goes to 17. Yeah. And uh, C scaling as well. Goes to C. But it's a better C. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you know about that. Yes. Uh, we Well, I think it occurred also in the previous one. 
So that is C demons. to C plus. Yeah. But you don't see the actual plus or minus. It's blue, it's good. But it's blue, it's good. Like balls. And it's stupid because it should just tell you. Yeah. But fuck telling you things. <laughs> so you can see the improvement there. Okay. Um, well, I'm sure I'm going to put some souls into that claymore. How long are you going to Oh, yeah, I didn't for? check uh, that halberd. You yet. didn't check the halberd yet. So shards, uh, so yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 shards you can buy. Oh. So that's the thing is, uh, so you can you can look at these like little upgrades here, right? Okay. Shields as well. But the thing about shields when you go to upgrade them, if you take if just out of curiosity. So let's say you're looking at, yeah. You're increasing not the damage reduction. It's the stability. Exactly. <laughs> 63, 63, 63 plus. <laughs> Okay. Soft touch. Yeah. But you're not making it block magic fire or lightning better. And you're not going above 100% damage reduction. Okay. So, it's like, yeah, 110%. It heals you when you block it. Yeah. But uh, you're increasing your stability if you decide to upgrade a shield. Uh, okay. So that's your, your uh, screen for that. Armor is, of course, the you know the same thing for your, your various armors. Take them up to plus five with... Uh, Shards and, and yeah, chunks and all kinds of stuff. Some armor is unupgradable, but you can see the numbers. Don't fuck around. You get a decent increase if you happen to like what you yeah. wear. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But you got a. But it's the beginning. Exactly. Yeah. And it just takes something and called twinkling. Takes, yeah. Tonight. Oh so, man. So specialized armors are going to take specialized upgrade material. Okay. Um, you better be sure you want it. Yeah. You skipped the purchase. Be careful there. I just want to check out the halberd first. And then, uh, well, I guess I could look at his wares first. Well, hello again. You seem to be doing all right. Need anything forged? What are you selling? Shards. 800 a pop. So, okay. basic material here. You can upgrade things. Uh... He the, has an infinity of shards? He can, yes. Okay. So you can always buy more shards and get things. Uh, so shards uh, are, are going to get your weapons to at least... Um, at least plus three? I, I, I might be full of shit. Here um, it says plus five on the description. Oh, excuse me. There you go, right? And then you're going to need large shards to go beyond that. Oh, yeah, there was another one that was like 14 or exactly. something. Exactly. Yeah. So you'll be able to... But, but this is a... This is a purchasable uh, material that you can get whatever you want at least up to up five if you okay. spend the money on it that's good he has all other things too he does damn what he else has, has he smith got smith boxes and crests of artorias artorias this crest opens a door in the dark root garden sealed by ancient magic the door leads to the grave of sir artorias the abyss walker many adventurers have left for the grave but none have returned for they make easy prey for local bandits. Such dangers, the crest can do more harm than good in the hands of the uninitiated. Unish Sounds cool. How much does that cost? 20k. Alright. Twenty K and don't die. <laughs> don't lose these twenty get there with the twenty K unless you pop a big soul or something crazy like that. I mean, still big numbers for me. Well, you can you can spend that. You can teleport home and spend that. You know. Yeah, that's true. So don't worry too much. About I remember that. losing twenty k in yeah. the previous game in the bog when you left for a drink. <laughs> Shit. Uh, he smells a Smith box. Tool used to etch titanite into weapons for reinforcements. Rest at a bonfire to make weapon reinforcement possible. So you don't have to come here every time you want to make a weapon up to plus five. And it's 2k. You can sit at your bonfire and do it yourself. And then the armor smith box, same thing. But pretty, for armors. Pretty handy. Okay. Mm. What else does he sell? The long sword, mm -hmm. which I think we have. Yep. The broad sword. Wide blade of the straight sword emphasizes slicing and has no thrust attack. The horizontal sweeping motion makes this sword effective against multiple enemies, clearing mobs. Okay. What about this? The bastard sword. If you want to go LARPing, mm -hmm. this is your sword. 
Standard great sword is normally wielded with two hands due to its great weight. Usually strong in large arcs and effective against multiple foes. Far from ideal when fighting in tight quarters. Don't want to be hitting those walls. Yeah, no corridors for me. Battle axe. Standard battle axe inflicts regular damage, making it effective in various situations. Powerful attack due to its weight, but one wrong swing leaves the wielder wide open, so timing and proximity to the enemy must be judged carefully. So, uh, that is something you're going to see. That's that's what the halberd has as well, since you haven't checked it out. And you're going to see there's weapons where you swing and you see what you get. And then there's weapons where you swing, and if you whiff, you have a little bit of a stumble. If you don't whiff, you're fine. Okay. Okay. And Don't miss. Some of those weapons are like, they give you better damage, but don't miss. Exactly. Okay. So you trade off, like, you know, throw whiff animation. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I don't want that to happen. It's, it's, uh, exactly. So this is a better axe than the one you, you, you were rocking, for example. The hand axe? Yeah. We'll check the stats on it. Right. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's doing... 95 yes. on, on your swings, but exactly, you're gonna you're gonna uh, see a little bit of a, st- a stumble if you will. Doke, war pick hammer with a large beak shaped pommel. Originally a pickaxe redesigned for battle. Simple but deadly weapon that hits heavily with thrust damage, such that is it easily cracks metal armor. Okay, pretty cheap. The Caestus. Cestus. Cestus. The weapon augments one's bare hands with thick studded leather. The Cestus has short reach but quick cooldown. Amount of damage inflicted is dependent on its wearer's strength. You like punching shit? It looks pretty cool. But I think I'm good for now. I'd rather uh, chop. Yeah. Chop, chop, chop. Guess what? I love punching shit. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. (laughs) It's not worth it. Too bad. But I love, I love the idea. I love the idea. And and when I, like I said, there's that that time when the like it was a fun invasion. Was a dude jumped in and he dropped two of these plus five. And he's like, let's go, let's go. <laughs> like, all right, let's do it. And we did it. It was good. The pike, long spear with a very long red hilt, traditionally used by groups of soldiers, specifically designed for distance thrust- thrusting, has the longest range of the non-projectile weapons, but its very length makes it somewhat difficult to handle. You get range, you Another, get thrust. Another uh, shield and stab in. Yep. Uh, large leather shield. Oh, we have three shields. Large leather covered round shield. Choice shield for hunters. Wood shields are lighter than metal shields, but with lower physical damage reduction and reduced shield stability. Uh, the tower kite. Medium metal shield decorated with a tower, the symbol of protection. A standard, widely used, widely used shield. Mm-hmm. And the Caduceus kite shield, medium metal shield, decorated by the ancient blue Caduceus. Standard, widely used shield as well. Uh, yeah, so you're gonna, um, blah. If you go back and you just, you can look at the numbers to see what each of these things actually looks like. So yeah, not 100%. What's the point? Uh, here you got 100. Fire is up to 70. And then... Decent stability. These stats are Mm -hmm. the same. More or less. Mm, what about the same weight? All right. It's a shield. It's better than what I have, though. Oh, um, I mean, you currently have 100% physical reduction. Yeah. So what you're... Here, here, okay. So here's what you're going to be seeing, right? Stability is lower than what you have because your stability is at 63. So uh, there's that. But the... 100% physical reduction is good. You're going to look at multiple shields that have that, and then you'll see the magic, fire, lightning, and stability change. Yeah. And you have to choose what you want for each situation. So, um, there will be times when you're like, this is a hot area. Let me put on the fire reduction. And then you'll have the one with big high fire, and you might sacrifice a little bit of magic and stability for that, but you choose that for that area. Yeah. And different shields that are worth considering are all going to have. 100 physical and a different version of those next four numbers. Yeah. Okay. Or uh, high high numbers across the board and it's going to weigh like fucking 16 pounds. I'll be seeing you then. Be careful out there. Yeah. Okay, so we came down to him. Yeah. So find a safe spot to mm-hmm. try the halberd. 
right by the bonfires, great. And you've also got, uh, you got those souls. True, I need to spend them on, oh, uh, should I get some tools from him, like boxes? Do you think it's worth it, or should I just level up? I mean, the boxes are always going to be worth it for the long run, okay. no matter what. The question is just... Uh, when? Yeah. Um, what, what time... Um, not what time, sorry. What cost were they? Were they a thousand? Uh, two thousand? Okay. I think they were two K. Okay, well, I mean, you could you could come back and spend on that. Uh, you could also make your sword hit stronger. Um, and, or you can, you know, hold out for something that does more, whatever. Mm. Right now you're doing good damage with that sword. I, I, yeah, you know, it's pretty I good. Lie. Yeah. I don't think I'll use the halberd, but let's test it out. Test it out. So. And I'll, and I'll tell you this. The thing you get from the dragon tail is a weapon. Okay. Just so that you know, it's not a, it's not like a, yeah. All right. So that's your whiff. That's your crowd control. Ooh, okay. What about? Okay. Advancing crowd control. It's a stab. No yeah. kicks. Oh, there is a kick. Mm -hmm. And roll. Sweep. Big sweep. Okay. Um, and shield up. Oh, yeah. No, this doesn't allow it. Because of the shield that I have? Or no, the no, halberd? no. The, the halberd doesn't doesn't, ah, doesn't attack with okay. the shield up. Yeah. So I think the pike would do it. Um, and um, the, there's, a, there's a couple other thrusting spears mm. that will allow it, but uh, the halberd's not one of them. Okay, so... I have almost two K souls. What do you want to prioritize? Um, leveling up. Okay, so pop those levels. Uh, well, go do, go do the math upstairs by the bonfire. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I was going to him. I need to go to him if I want to level up my stuff and gear. Back. But yeah, I, 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 some people just frivolously level up gear. I kind of, I'm like, because it, ultimately it's, it, it is money. But like, it's one of those things where it's like, if you put something into something, you're going to want to use that thing, you know? So uh, as long as you're feeling it, but uh, then it's a, it's a good decision if you like what you're rolling with. But you never know when you're going to pick up something cool. That's, that's always, that's the rule of these games, you know? But at the very least up to plus five, it ain't, it ain't that bad. Once you start getting into the higher end stuff, there's like final upgrades that are like, that's one per game or two per game. Like, there's a limit on maxing stuff out for sure, you know? Then I need, Unless you do like PvP and stuff. Yeah, I need like 300 some more for another level. Shit. All right. What are you feeling? Like so. Okay. At some point I'll put vitality, maybe next time. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so there are uh, there are things in this game that are still reminiscent of, if you remember, uh, quality from Demon Souls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where it's like even strength, even, even dex. strength, even dex. Yeah. There are weapons that like ask you for even strength, even dex. Um, in this game, so you'll always be able to find something that you know suits what you're uh, what you're building towards. I'm down with it. Okay, so we keep going. Uh, wait, am I forgetting something up there? You have the inside of that church building where you were getting, uh, where you saw the big, big, big boy, and you saw the, um, the the magic. You have this area you can take a look at. Sometimes I hear tingles, and I'm like, is that a shiny? But there's no tingles. There's no, like, little lizards in this, right? There are absolutely lizards oh, yeah? in this game. You just haven't encountered any. Okay. There was one in front of the Taurus demon boss, but uh, you think you missed it. Wow. Tears ahead. 
Be wary of Charmer. Be wary of tough enemy. Hey, uh, are you okay? absorbed in thought. I am Ziegmeier of Katarina. Quite honestly, I've run flat up against a wall. Or a gate, I should say. The thing just won't budge. No matter how long I wait. And oh, but I wait. So, here I sit, in quite a pickle, weighing my options, so to speak. <laughs> how about that armor with the fat rolls? Yeah, he's chunky. Pretty cool. The helmet. What does it look like? It's like an onion, no? Yeah, it, it does. <laughs> Still closed. Still closed. Mm. <coughs> Still closed. Still closed. Nothing more to mm. say, huh? Mm. Okay. Yeah, he's just gonna chill. He's sitting and thinking. I see something beyond. Not really. It's hard to peek through. Just some blood. <laughs> Nothing on this side. I guess we'll come back later. Sure. Some cardboard trees. <laughs> no openings here on the side of the path. Yeah. Ah, oh, green. So beautiful. No, really, orange is what's beautiful in this game. And every time you kindle a bonfire, it gets bigger. So that flame gets bigger because you, yeah, you juiced it with some, uh, some of your inner essence. Oh, wow. Your humanity is burning. Okay. Cool. Um... So, uh, you had... Yeah, uh, the missing path up there. Right? Yeah, so you had, you had the inside of the area with the big guy and then the, the magic in the back. And you had the room beneath um, the, the beneath uh, Andre, or the door, I should say. Yeah, that's facing him. Oh, damn. That's not what I wanted. Horizontal. Yeah, I wanted the horizontal yep, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least when you get close to this dude, he stops shooting arrows. So yeah. that's a handy thing for moments when you are uh, trying to stop some of that bullshit. Oh, so look at that. It's your first summon sign. You can take a look at it right over there. It's that little... Uh, this thing. Yeah. So you can stand next to it. You can see somebody. And if you touch it, without actually confirming someone called twitch chat has just laid his summon sign down so <laughs> okay uh, you can promptly ignore this and cancel that shit <laughs> but now you're seeing all these people who want to play along with you i see okay so we came from this side you sure did and then they're all naked bunch of streakers whoa oh my god Look at him, look at him! And then there's this dude behind me that's shooting. And you forgot about all the dudes in here? Oh my god! Oh well, it's over. <laughs> the classic. Yep, yep, yep. The yep, classic yep. backing up into no. the, into the shit that <laughs> you know is there. Oh yeah, I was gonna clearly pay attention to that while I was super afraid I know. of the big boss. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Just as planned. Yep. Oh my god. Remember, remember what that room was. There okay, but how would I get behind them? And clear it. Uh, I need to remember. Well, you're coming at it from the backside, and they didn't. They didn't start running at you until you walked over there. Yeah. So don't go there. Uh huh. 
So there goes that humanity. Now the signs are gone. Okay. You're, you're back to being undead. Nope. So luckily these pole pillars are like letting you go through them as opposed to walls. That's a good thing. Yeah. But verticals in these halls yeah. are... Uh, I was expecting it to situation. hit the wall, but it didn't. I gotta learn. Are you gonna heal? We're doing... Okay, so... Uh... Okay, well, I... If you, you can actually, I went you can, this you, way, you and then look, I turned you, everywhere. Yeah, you can actually look around a little bit. Right? So you can peekaboo peek right up there. And he's peekabooing back. And now it's a 1v1. Want some of this? Want some, some of this? <laughs> okay, well, we'll drink. Let's drink. Let's drink. Truce. 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 <laughs> Now you're gonna get it. Oh yeah, rain on me. Mmm, wet. Real wet. Okay. All right. Okay. Pyromancers. Good job. Nice kill. If you rely on uh, fireballs to do most of the work for you, you're gonna suffer in a bit. As your first engagement choice. But it does well. Oh man, why you have to tell me that? Because <laughs> it's a nice don't. Because you, you, now you didn't have to get up close and deal. You deleted him from. You deleted the engagement, right? Yeah. So you don't actually have to deal with that guy or know what he does because you just burned him away. Yeah. And because it was a problem solver, there might be problems that come that you won't be able to solve. All right. Keep it in mind. They're grenades. Uh. I want my souls. But it definitely gets the problem out of the way. So you know. Oh! Don't go this way, you idiot! Target! Oh my god! All right, let's 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 move. That was, by the way, that wasn't so much a don't do that as a like in the future. If you use it as a crutch, it will bite you in the butt. And, and also, like, choose where you're gonna use those fireballs each time you sit. Because you only get a couple. Back up, back up. One, two, three. Oh, okay. That's good. That's good. Hey, chill, 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 chill. Chill. All right. There you go. And one. I'm being so careful. Am I being too careful? Who knows? Let's drink. We have a bunch. Not a bad drink. All right. Well, now you, now you pulled them over. Yeah. But they don't seem to care unless you walk all the way over there. Okay. Just... I don't even remember how many souls I dropped. One. Just one. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. That's good. You're down, you're down. And? Baller gauntlets. Baller gauntlets. Get, okay, okay, hold on. And that set piece by piece. One at a time, one they, at a time. It's a low drop. Get your your default R2 as well when the opening is. And the follow-up. Cool. R2. R2, R2, then, R2 then swing up. up. Yeah. Oh, that was nothing. Alright. So, um there's a magic dude on top. There is. And then what's going on over, over here? There? Oh my god. 
fire another one. That ain't bad. Oh, you think you're cool, huh? You think you're you're really? He wait actually until, he re, he thinks he's really cool. He thinks he's so really got, hot. Yeah, and then you got a little uh, something over here. The elevator action. Elevator action. Classic L uh, NES game. Yep. There was a passageway on top. Check out I this. I missed zone. the floor. No, no. The other, yeah, you, there's an opening up yeah. there. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> oh! Okay! Welcome home. Oh my god! Yo, let's. <laughs> Let's walk around a bit. Let's go. <laughs> Shit. Shortcut porn. Uh, it's this dude. Oh, hello. Anything new to say? Miracles, I presume. Yes, I know. Okay. And what did he have? Big old faithy miracles. Over 2K. That required a talisman, a talisman. and faith. Yeah. Of which I have one talisman, but no faith. How much faith have you got? No faith. All right. Well, come again. The effectiveness of the teachings depend upon your faith. Hey, you ain't believing in shit. <laughs> <laughs> you believe in yourself. I gotta. Which is pyromancy. It I, comes from within. I gotta. The fire comes from within. You ever think to forge your weapons? Sometimes. You'd better find a smith box soon, unless you enjoy swinging about with blunt instruments. <laughs> okay, okay. So is he done? Exhaust the dialogue because they update from time to time. How did that silly sorcerer's apprentice end up? You know, the one always prattling on about Master Logan. He left for the undead burg, but never came back. Serves him right. If even old Big Hat can't make it out there, what chance does he have? I hope he enjoys his new life as a hollow. Logan. So, like, even... Remember, like, even the, like, sorcerer's apprentice and sorcerer that they're talking... Even that, it's like, hey, remember Demon Souls? Yeah. Remember the sorcerer and the sorcerer's apprentice? Like, they just do it again. <laughs> the recipe works. We just do it again. The formula works. Hmm? What now? I'm not up for chat. Okay, now we're done. Now he's done. Hey, you want to check out that Firekeeper soul? Is it a different? Or is it similar to the other one? Every description is unique, ah. despite the fact that they have the same name. Okay, that's good to know. Yes. It's... Very good to know. Fire Keeper Soul boosts power of Estus Flask. Each Fire Keeper is a corporeal manifestation of her bonfire and a draw for the humanity which is offered to her. Her soul is gnawed by infinite humanity and can boost the power of precious Estus Flasks. It can be used to gain humanity and restore HP at the cost of losing the Fire Keeper Soul to reinforce the Estus Flask. So the fire, the, the bonfires that are kindled, uh, that by a firekeeper, um, yeah, basically like sh they're linked to each other, and her humanity, which is you know infinitely like there's an infinite amount being fed to the, the bonfire, is what keeps those things going. So, if you want to use this when you find one uh, to make your Estus flask stronger, you take it to her. Okay, yeah, and then she will give you a plus two Estus flask. That sounds good. She's downstairs. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, this way. Nope. No. To the right of uh, the crestfallen guy. Well, his right. Your left. Oh, on the way to the downstairs. The murky murk. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Around this bend. Nice menu drop. Reinforce. Yes. Plus two. I wish we could talk. I wish we could talk. She can't speak, man. 
You want some food? No, no response. Okay. All right. Back up. So now you got a direct link from Firelink back up to that castle and where the smith is. How fucking sick is that? <laughs>